It's the news we've all been waiting for. Microsoft 365 Copilot is now available for everyone. Yes, <laughs> really. Let me take you through the announcement that just came through this week. And the headline point here is that there's no 300 seat minimum purchase anymore. I'm just going to clap for a moment. Clap along with me if you're as happy about this as I am. So there are three pieces of this announcement. The first thing I'm going to talk to you about is the options for commercial or business customers. Then we'll talk about education customers. And finally, individuals, there's something there for you too. Starting with the commercial licenses, minimum purchase is just one now. Yes, <laughs> yes, really. So you do need to have some kind of Microsoft plan underneath this though for the whole thing to work. Copilot for Microsoft 365 by definition is working in those Microsoft 365 applications. Word, Teams, Outlook, PowerPoint, Excel, OneNote and more. So you need to have a license for those things. And then the Copilot is an add on to that. So if you are in a small business category, you need to have either the Microsoft 365 Business Standard, Microsoft 365 Business Premium. You'll see each of these now says Copilot for Microsoft 365 available as an add on. These come with all of the apps you need. And the price is in US dollars, $30 per user per month. On the enterprise side, you previously had to have E3, Microsoft 365 E3 or E5. Now you can do it at the enterprise level with Office 365 E3 or E5 as well. Difference between those plans is that the Microsoft 365 licenses have a bunch of extra security protection and things, but in terms of the applications that are used for Copilot, it's going to be exactly the same. So we're lowering the level in there as well. What about education customers? Yes, available for education customers as well. Same price. Minimum requirement here is that you have Microsoft 365 A3 or A5 faculty, just checking my notes to make sure I'm telling you the right thing, or Office 365 A3 or A5 faculty. So this is very similar comparative to what we just saw. For nonprofits, we haven't seen an announcement about any pricing there, but obviously you can purchase all of these things based on those same underlying licenses. If there's any update on that, I will certainly be making an announcement here. Now, what if you're not a business? I know a lot of people are individuals and they want access to this stuff too. So the thing is that with Microsoft Copilot for Microsoft 365, that is by definition working with these applications that are part of a business way of working. However, for individuals now, we have something new, which is called Copilot Pro. Another way of using the brand, we're going to unpick this a little bit. So Copilot Pro is sitting at a price tag of $20 US per user per month. I'll just click the little video here to give you a sense of it. This is based on Microsoft Copilot, previously known as Bing Chat, where you've got your web browser, you've got these premium GPT models and image generation available in your web browser with your web context available to you. So that's all still there. You can have that for free. But Copilot Pro is giving you more. It's actually giving you something similar to that Microsoft 365 Copilot, but for an individual user. So the difference here is that it's working in Word, Excel, PowerPoint, Outlook, and OneNote on PC, Mac, and iPad. First thing I noticed there is that the Teams piece is missing. There's a difference in that price point. But I think that makes sense because if you're an individual user and you need to be here on a Microsoft 365 personal or family plan, you're not likely to be using Teams in that way that businesses do. So if you're in that individual category, you can get this too and you can use it for your own personal productivity across those apps if you're making things in Word and PowerPoint. I'm going to get my hands on this as a personal user and test it out and see what it can do. The other important thing here is that you're getting access to premium models. So you'll see here GPT-4 Turbo, including during peak times and more boosts and speed with that image generation in there. So you can still use Microsoft Copilot for free if you don't need all of this stuff. But if you're an individual and you want to start bringing it into the apps and getting access better access to those premium models. This one is for you. I'm going to keep doing updates and content on this stuff. I love all of this. Thank you all for your encouragement and support on this content. Pop any questions you have in the comments here and I will endeavor to find as many answers as I can as we work through this. And tell me your experience about this stuff. Have fun. If you'd like to know more about what Microsoft 365 Copilot can do, 
check out my video here that takes you through it all. Thanks for watching.